Late October, but Chelsea had yet to concede a Premier League goal at Stamford Bridge. And that record faced a stern test as Arsene Wenger's high-flying Arsenal arrived in West London. The last victims at Stamford Bridge had been Manchester United, whom Chelsea had dispatched 5-0, a result that confirmed Gianluca Vialli's title ambitions. Vialli continued with Chris Sutton up front alongside Torre Andre Flo, while Gianfranco Zola had to be content with a place on the bench. Chelsea had a poor recent record against Arsenal, and with Emmanuel Petit partnering Ray Parler in midfield, and Tony Adams along... Your match commentator is Martin... More than four years now since Chelsea last beat Arsenal in the league. So in that particular record, and they of course have been the side that have set the defensive standards in this league. As well, touched by Flo, Tyler in quickly, Keown for company. Brian so playing on the left-hand side of midfield these days, ahead of Babayaro. And his persistence is an old rivalry there between Dixon and Lasso. Lee Dixon was sent off after a, a fracas with Graham Lasso in this fixture last season. And it's Dixon who gets a card here at Stamford Bridge inside a couple of minutes today. Pushed it too far ahead of himself. Lovely flick by Petit. Parler fastening onto it, a shot a long way wide, but a shot. Very much back in some style. Here's Sutton. Oh, and that must have been close, but the flag has stayed down. Arsenal not happy with that. Plenty of Chelsea players prepared to attack it. Desai is there, Flo, of course, and Chris Sutton. Coming through the crowd and getting to it. Sutton also a scorer against Manchester United in the 5 0. His first Premier League. He's signing out for Le Berf and he hasn't done that. And uh, Shuker Kanu! Well, Chelsea with this faultless defensive record. In home league games, were looking vulnerable here. And actually, uh, could have been cleared. Sir Richard Attenborough. I'm not really borne out by the uh, last attempted pass. White. Right. Only got something to try and find. But Chris Sutton was offside. David Seaman not looking across and spotting the flag and having to react to the situation as if the flag had stayed down. But. Why he's got it forward. And so, he's just being tugged back then. Dixon, another little cameo of the contest, really. Players given no time to dwell in possession. And so, went down as LeBeuf back heeled the ball. And uh, Alan Wilkie. Too impressed. With the that just changed the angle, which made good sense. Sutton behind Desai. The delivery was better. As the ball was rolled to Celestine. Kanu. Oh, and Shuke. Claiming that uh, it should be a corner, but that was neat passing from Arsenal again, with Freddie Jungberg cutting the ball back to. Petrescu looks across towards Torre Andre. Flo! Puts it in the corner, sweet as you please. First blood to Chelsea at Stamford Bridge. Petrescu's cross. And Flo leaving Seaman flat footed. Perfect placement from the Norwegian who got his goal scoring touch back in midweek in Turkey with a vengeance. And has certainly. Dixon again. Kanu. Oh, the ball dropped for Mark.
mark over Mars. It came to him very quickly after a rescuing clearance from Chelsea. Just had to lean back. Keenan slow to pick himself up. And uh, team get the second half underway. Uh, it's found, but Chelsea couldn't build from that. Dixon caught in possession by Graham Lasso. Torre Andre Flo pushed out by Seaman. Flo goes in again. Well, Arsenal caught in possession in their own defensive third. Lee Dixon here. His old adversary Graham Lasso. And Torre Andre. And two to try and take on. He's got a free kick for obstruction. Referee responding to the advice of his assistant. Wise, Lasso. Two now. Dan Petrescu unmarked. The player who crossed for the first goal surprises himself maybe by heading in the second, but Arsenal were nowhere near him. Lovely work by Wise. Superb delivery by Graham Lasso, take nothing away from Dixon. Canu. Oh, this is maybe a chance for Arsenal here. Made uh, a four-man wall. It isn't quite as tight as it should be. This may be now. That's Dixon. They're concentrated on... Uh, Accuracy rather than power. Possibly the most awkward moment so far for Ed Flo. And Chelsea are on the move again. Torre Andre Flo. Might go all the way himself. And here's Henri. Oh, it's misjudged by LeBeuf. Chased by Shuke, Kanu in the centre. Referee just checking with his assistant as to whether that... Uh... Dixon. Over Mars. Kanu! And Chelsea have conceded at Stamford Bridge for the first time in the Premiership this season. Ed Dehoe's crowd record is broken by Kanu, a long leg. Prodding the ball into the far corner before De Huy could get out a long arm to keep it out. Well, battle very much back on again. 2-1. Still more than 15 minutes to go. Something... The berth drawn out of the middle. Puts it in low. Kanu! 2-2! The Nigerian has made it a nightmare for Chelsea, but such delight for Arsenal. And he found space again when Chelsea had somehow lost the key to the padlock. Even given Arsenal's revered capacity for digging in deep. Adams. Straight up in the air by Deshaw. Can Arsenal get a boot to it here if they can? There might be a chance for a goal from Overmars. It's Arsenal now who are calling the tune. Three minutes past. They've lost the 2 0 lead. Can they get back in front again? Zola takes it. Well, David Seaman was covering that post. Well, it's broken the Kanu's way and Dehu is right out of the centre. It's Kanu, what's he going to do? Oh! Can you believe it? He's flattened Chelsea. He's hit a hat trick at Stamford Bridge. This is simply extraordinary. And... Final whistle, and no wonder Arsenal arms go up. Arsene Wenger, 50 yesterday, has got his birthday present. His team were 2-0.